guys, what's up? And welcome back to another Vlogmas episode. If you're new here, hi, I'm Michelle and this is my channel. So guys, as promised, today we are actually going to be doing a rest house update because the last time we did this, I think it was like months ago or siguro last year pag yun, like, like everything was not here pa like it was a total skeleton and everything was under construction pag yun. well actually some of the parts here are actually still under construction but I decided to do this rest house update just to like give you guys an update on everything that is actually done the good here in the rest house. So we actually have a lot of things that we have already finished. Um, the pool is actually about 80% done. Wala lang like water pa, so that's why 80% done pa siya. So the living room, the dining area, the kitchen, everything is like set up now. We just have to add a few furnitures pa dayon, and the bedrooms are good enough to like stay in now. Because my siblings didn't really set up their bedrooms, so it's like total plain lang yun compared to mine. So anyway, you guys are gonna check that one out as we go along with the rest house tour. So let's go ahead and start the tour. Let's go. So this is actually the main door, like the main area where you enter from the gate. So I'm gonna show you guys the gate. So this is actually the gate, like that. There, and we have our cars parked over there, like my car, my dad's car, and my siblings and other family members are actually not here, so it's just us. So, over here in this side is actually an open lawn that I'm gonna show you guys later, but right now, let's just go inside. So let's go inside the mound. So, upon entering, you guys are gonna be directed to this part of the house, which is actually the snack bar. So this is the snack bar, guys. It actually has a lot of drinks there. Well, actually, it's not a lot. Because I don't want to eat my grandma. It's not a place. We actually had a rule before that when you take a drink there, you have to replace it so that it won't look empty. So it doesn't follow, obviously. And there's just basically one, two, three, four, five drinks there. And most of it will be in the room. So yeah, we're gonna be repeating that on Christmas though. But over here, we have here a few snacks like junk foods and then... And here we often put some um, go-to snacks on like something that you can grab along the way. Like some candies and... Hurut ng bread. <laughs> we also place the bread there and a few other things. Like over here, we have a stock of junk foods and down there we just place all of the board games, mga Jenga, mga ganun. Over here we have my favorite fridge of all time because it has my favorite drinks. <laughs> Coke. <laughs> so yeah, that's basically the snack bar. And moving to this side, we actually have the living area. This is where my dad watched my vlogs. <laughs> Guys, promise that Gabi, madugan na ako kung self here. Kay for me, place akong papa ko mga vlogs. So, over here, we actually have, since it's Christmas, we have the Christmas tree. This is actually from Shopee lang that I bought. So, this is our mini Christmas tree, and we have a TV here, also electric fan. And, well, actually, we don't really need electric fan here because it's so, so, so cold here. Like, siguro 24-7, 24-7 cold yet. Like, wala yung face, guys, na dinitog na. So, taste ganda ni ako outfit. <laughs> Tugno yung outfit, guys. But anyway, this is the couch. We actually uh, DIY'd this one. Like, my dad and my brother were the ones to, like, really make this. No, diligid sila nag make, but sila nag pa make. This is an L shaped couch with this mini desk area where you can, like, place your laptop. This is actually where I do most of my online classes since mas malakas yung Wi-Fi dito compared to my room. So this is where I set up. So also has a socket here so it's very convenient. So yeah, this is basically the living area and now let's go to the kitchen and the dining area. <laughs> so over here, this is actually the kitchen which I don't really stay here that much because I don't cook. So we have here our refrigerator which has Mga sudan, mga inanak, mga sudan, 
Pagluto. The kitchen din siya. <laughs> so here the sink. Tapos this is where we do the cooking. And also a counter bar to like have enough space to prepare. So this is where we usually put the lechon then <laughs> most of the time. So so yeah, this is basically the kitchen area where most of the cooking happen. Like obviously kitchen. And on the side we actually have this long table here that is wooden then as well. It's actually from my mom's collection before because <laughs> See guys, the construction for the game. But anyway, guys, I can make my figure so clear. But anyway, guys, okay, time back. A few moments later. So over here we actually have the dining area where we basically eat <laughs> and we have this really long table, wooden table that we actually restored them. Like this was from my mom's collection before like she was obsessed with wooden things because before but this was actually restored now because na daot siya before since wala kay siya na use and like na padaplin lang and all that stuff but this is good as new now because they were able to like replenish it and like varnish and all that stuff so so i really like it because it kind of adds accent to the whole area so over here we also actually have this cute view here cute good <laughs> pero yeah this is actually the view for the dining area which I really really like because you know I often stay here since I always like to eat so um, every time I stay here I really enjoy the view because it has this wide um, window here and also has this really huge um, sliding door that where you can basically see through the view so before we move outside let's do a quick tour of what's inside here like we basically have five rooms here for us five because five me siblings so my dad actually decided five rooms for each one of us starting with my sister the eldest one number one <laughs> and then number two <laughs> which is for my kuya <laughs> number three but this was actually for Marvi kay since she ang third na nga sibling but since we got here first during the construction we decided to swap rooms because um, the the placement of the doors were different so uh, Marvie actually moved to my room and I moved to my younger sister room because younger sisters na room kaya mas chada dito kay I think I feel like mas tako siya but anyway this is Marvie's room Tada. I'm not gonna show it down <laughs> and then this is Marvie's room is it open? It's locked. All of the rooms, guys, like all of the four rooms were actually so empty pa because my siblings didn't pay that much attention to like decorate their rooms. But when you go to the end, you're gonna enter my garden room, which actually, which is actually filled with things. Now, I actually did a room tour now on this one, so I'm not really gonna show you the details of my room, but you guys can check out my room tour on this bedroom. So, I really have here an instant, what do you call that? passageway to like go outside the balcony so when you open this this directly leads to the outside world <laughs> I nugget I mean, I get tour the nugget and then over here this is the balcony which also leads to my siblings na mga rooms there and yeah come on guys let's go down yeah we're gonna go to Pa, go video ko pa. Hello. Hi. Go <laughs> vlog ko na. Okay, so since we are done na in that part of the house, we are going to go down to like check out the other places that we actually added. So let's go. Over here we actually have the pool na wala pa water because we're going to find a source pa for our water na sana so, titagan na water pump something so it's actually empty pa but we had it cleaned yesterday because sinagat si Giyog swimming here so this is the pool Tada, it's empty pa it's actually like five or six feet deep dito sa edge and here we also have like this area along where we can chill and where my dad gets to drink his beer with his friends if ever we decide to stay here suppose so beside the pool guys we actually have these reclining chairs that you know that serves its purpose whenever we like to swim. We just sit here and enjoy the view. Like, look at the view here in the pool. Ta da! Go down. 
we actually have a swing area here. Tada! This is where I like to muni muni. So over here, guys, we are actually in our mini movie theater in our room. We're supposed to have a projector here, but I don't know where he placed it. But yeah, this is basically where we pull down our projector, like the white screen thing. Yeah, we pull that one down and the projector, we just place it here to like have a movie time. I'm gonna insert a clip of how it looks like, but yeah. When you step here, step like that, check and so you get to enjoy the view and the wind as well so yeah this is where my dad likes to tap by most of the time and ligid ligid lang dahil dere ang mga dogs with him so what I really like about here as well is we also actually place these light bulbs here for aesthetic purposes so it lights up at night which is really cool I'm gonna insert a clip guys of how it's gonna be like at night so I really like to um, stay here at night and watch a movie because it's really cool and don't worry because we actually have access to Wi-Fi here you can do this house you can do this house we actually have an extension for the Wi-Fi here so um, we get to watch Netflix at the same time so going here we actually have an open space you can eat and play beer pong here because the view is really nice as well. Where you have this whole view all to yourself. So I like to stay here then to do TikToks because the view is really nice. But it's kind of hot here so let's go down. So going down, it actually leads us here to Michelle's karaoke room. So we basically have here some tables. Here a counter bar to like mix mix mga drinks and all that stuff. And we also have some tables to like Play beer pong then as well, like here. And the body, okay, pala hobo. Pero anyway, so have a water dispenser here and a refrigerator as well to store the drinks if ever we decide to bring our friends over here. So, this is actually the karaoke room. So, over here, this is just a small room, but it's like the VIP room, no, sir, Grace. So, yeah, we also actually have an air condition here because this is an enclosed area where we can basically enjoy and like have karaoke night with our friends. In this karaoke room, we actually have this mini stage for me. So, we get to sit here and I really like this placard. Placard is called that. I really like this signage, the neon signage. I just got this from Shopee because I just feel like I'm a total singer with this one. So, so gusto mo sample, guys? <laughs> So <laughs> anyway, this is basically the mini stage. This is basically the setup. So we also actually have these um, leather chairs attached to it for the viewers, the audience, sapo um, ang cover, sapo ang cover on session. So over here we also have some chairs as well all the way there, and the fixtures and the lights are just there. So. Turn that up and let's move to the guest the room. So going out from the karaoke room, Michelle's karaoke room, it actually leads us to this hallway going to the restroom and to the guest the room. So over here, we actually have two uh, comfort rooms. This one, I haven't really checked this, but yeah, this is like a shower area. And then here, the toilet area. So, yeah, I'm not gonna show you because it's not done, but it's functional. Na siya. But anyway, we are moving now to the two guest rooms here. So this is actually the guest room now, which is actually prepared now almost. My sister's friends are actually gonna be staying here. And we also actually have a CR na there. So the CR outside is mainly for the karaoke people long. So this is the first guest room. So over here, we actually have a window so that you can have and access to the view at the same time. Double size bed for the guests and that is basically the guest rooms where most of our friends stay if ever they decide to have an overnight here. But moving here, we actually have the stairs. <laughs> Going up back to the house and to the pool side and in this pool side we actually have a generator as well like that one. So going up back here, we are actually back in the place where we started. So going there, we actually have a lot of trees planted here. Like as you can see. Woo! So yeah, we actually have a lot of trees planted here and we have pine trees, golden trees, mga ganon, just for aesthetic purposes. 
So, going here. Gamay na lang, guys. Go, Nata. <laughs> so, tada! We are finally here in the bonfire area. If you have seen my Vlogmas episode last year, this is actually where we like to have our drinks before. Like, wala pa to na construct a music room and all that stuff. So, it's basically our bonfire area. Like, we tried to uh, grill some mallows, some hot dog, and anak mga fields, guys, here. So, it was really cool. Like, it was a good experience. So, in here, we also actually have these bulb lights just for the aesthetic purposes. And yeah, this is basically the view. But uh, it actually kind of gets so cold here at night. So, every time we have our drinks here, naka hoodie and all that stuff, good me. Anyway, this is the bonfire area. And beside it, we actually have an ongoing construction for the gas gihapo na mga rooms. So let's go ahead and check it out. Oh, and by the way, guys, these trees are really cool because we actually placed some solar fairy lights on each tree. So every night, it kind of lights up and gives us a really cool Christmas vibe. So these are actually solar powered na mga lights. Like most of the um, outdoor lights here are all solar just to make it more Efficient. Shut up, efficient. Okay, we are moving to the last part of the guest house, which is actually the ongoing construction of our um, triangle guest house, the mga rooms. So this one is actually done now. We have, we are planning to put up three. One there, the other one is still on the framing. And let's go ahead and check it out. Ta da! Let's go inside. Come on. Come on here. Ta da! <laughs> Can you guys see it? Saka, man! It's basically what's inside lang in this room. Like, we're planning to put a foam here and siguro a bedside. Uh, table at the same time just so that you can have a place where you can put your things But what I really like about this one lang guys is that when you actually open this Trapal this aesthetic Trapal you get to access this really cute view so, ta -da! Ta -da! Come on. Come here, come here. so down there you can actually just jump up ah! <laughs> So don't worry guys it's not a cliff so anyway I I think that is basically all for our rest house update. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Well, actually, I was really planning to like make this the official Nagid na rest house tour, but I think we are still on the process of adding so much um, facilities here, guys. We're always gonna be like, oh, add the ani, oh, let's put up this one, let's add and add and add. So, diligent siya kahuman, guys. So, I think we're just gonna be having the final and official rest house tour. Next year, nagin siguro guys, because dagan kag per bigida ad. Pero yeah, that is basically the update for the rest house that I owe you guys because it's been so long since we did the rest house tour. But that is basically all for today's video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this and make sure to give this video a like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to turn on that notification bell button to be notified on our next upload. So I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!